Hello my dear family members, today I will give you an exciting news that is in this ongoing Accenture on campus drive, half of the coding questions are repeatedly asked from this year itself and the rest of the half are repeated from previous year. Now in this video we will discuss such a coding question which was asked on Accenture on campus drive 2023 and also asked on 2022 drive. So let's see what is the question. So the question is regarding regions on a plane. So Mr. Professor is a great scientist but he is not able to find a solution to one problem. There are n straight lines that are not parallel and no three lines go through the same point. The lines divide the plane into m regions. Uh, write a function to find out the maximum number of such regions he can get on the plane. So input specification is given here. So input 1 is an integer and representing the number of straight lines constraints are given and output specification this return the maximum number of regions and here is the sample input right so if input is 2 so output will be 4 how given the above scenario two lines divide the plane into four regions now i will show you a diagram which will make you clear about that right so at first look at this if one line drawn then two regions can be formed and if two line formed then four regions can be formed right and if three lines we draw then total seven region we can form right so i hope you got it right so now to solve this problem you can use a mathematical formula that calculates the maximum number of regions formed by n straight lines or the formula for finding the maximum number of regions formed by n lines that is this n into n plus one by two plus one right Okay, I hope you have got it. So if you think you can solve this problem now, so please pause the video and try to solve the problem by yourself, right? Okay, let's see what is the solution. So at first define a function uh, max regions, max regions, uh, let's say n, right? The number of line. So num is equal to this. So sorry, this could be n, right? Okay, now just return the num this will be fine okay now let's take the input then this will be okay right so if name is equal to is equal to main then just take the input and int input this is the number of lines right and answer is equal to max regions n and just print the answer then it will be okay right so what were the input so first input was two right so if two line drawn then four sorry name error max ridge sorry 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 okay now this will be okay so if two line drawn then four total plane can be formed right so we have to do this because uh, otherwise it will give float value right so we have to take uh, into integer value right okay now just take the input 2 then it will be 4 and take the input 3 this will be 7 right okay i hope you have got it right so this is as simple as that so just you have to know the formula to calculate total line can be formed uh, total region can be formed by n lines right so I hope this session was helpful to you. If you found this helpful, then please subscribe this channel and watch the playlist regarding Accenture on campus drive and please join this channel to get some exciting perks. So thank you for today's session.